Hello, right, okay, so we're going to try and do a one-shot video. Um, not my usual approach, normally film, script it, film it for like half an hour and then attempt to put it down to something approaching four minutes. Uh, but I've had a horribly, horribly stressful day, uh, an even worse, really bad mental health evening. Um, it's gone midnight uh, here and uh, the batch dying on my camera, so one-shot video, let's go. This week uh, we wanted to talk about Christmas. <gasps> Yay! Something uh, that we thought would be a bit, because we're all having quite busy, busy weeks and stressfulness and ah, uh, because it's two weeks to Christmas. Who let that happen? I don't know. Um, so uh, we've all got deadlines and work and presents and oh god, the stress. Uh, which is why we thought we'd have a nice, easy topic this week and do a little kind of feminist, pesky game, skip guy type shenanigans thing. Uh, which is basically just going to be us kind of being like, hey, here's some shit we like. You might like it too. Also, other people you know might like it. Um, yeah, basically, it's kind of because there's a lot of there's a lot of awful, awful commercialisation of Christmas, um, which I'm sure you're well aware of. Uh, and especially a lot of really awful uh, gender stereotyping of gifts like, you know, pink things for girls, blue things for boys, makeup packs, princess blah blah blah, um, you know, robots and science stuff for boys. Um, I was always more interested in the robots and science stuff, uh, make of that what you will. Um, but yeah, so here's some uh, stuff that I like because it's like a few minutes already. Ah, First thing uh, is this book. Uh, which is the Vagina Monologue, um, which is a book I imagine quite a lot of you have probably um, heard of, or maybe seen a play of, or maybe maybe even own a copy and read yourselves. Um, I haven't actually read a lot about feminism academically. Um, uh, that may be a surprise, that may be pretty obvious from my videos. Um, but this was the one of the first books that I read which really kind of turned me on to feminism, and sort of made me be like, like made me angry, made me want to do something. Um, I read it when I was about 17. Um, it's an amazing book. It is literally just sort of, you know, a book about vaginas. Uh, it's a book of, vag of vagina monologues, funnily enough. Um, taken, um, some of them are kind of almost direct transcripts, uh, it says in the book. Some of them are kind of amalgamations of what several women said. Um, put together by an amazing uh, woman called Eve Ensler. Um, and yeah, basically it's just, it's, there's things in there that will make you laugh, there's things in there that will make you cry, there's an amazing uh, uh, monologue about um, a word which I will not say now, even though I would normally like the C word, I would normally just say it, um, but I'm going to try and keep this video <laughs> for some reason nice and clean, I don't know what's wrong with me. Um, and generally it's just a really, really empowering book, um, which I just think every woman should read, and then think about your vagina. I would love to do, I, one of the things I thought about when I first started this channel was that I would really love to do a big YouTube vagina monologue thing uh, where we all take um, loads of different women on YouTube um, and, and you know, uh, people who don't identify with me as well um, and all take a vagina monologue uh, from the book uh, or you know, your, uh, create your own vagina monologue and just read it and then sort of put them all together. Maybe I'll start a new channel, maybe that's what I'll do in the new because uh, apparently we're starting channels now. Right, anyway, ramble, ramble, ramble. Oh god, four minutes. Okay, sorry, sorry. Um, this book. More things. Um, remember him? Remember Bagpuss? Um, yeah, uh, you know, a lot of women have crappy periods, as we found out last week. Um, do you know what makes a crappy period less crappy? Having a warm stuffed animal that you can hold. Um, basically, yeah, I mean, um, if you missed it, Bag just has a, a wheat bag inside him, which goes in the microwave, and it makes him warm and toasty, and it means that you can hug him and feel better, um, which is very important. Uh, other good things um, are, oh, I'm going to have to, oh, well, there's going to have to be an edit here, because I'm going to have to clip in a picture of it, um, but I saw these um, necklaces recently at a um, UK Feminista uh, event. Um, that I went to, um, which was um, uh, Fem 11, so it was a big feminist conference in London, which is really, really great. Um, and they had someone there who was selling these necklaces, and unfortunately I had no cash on me, so I couldn't buy one. Um, but I found their Etsy store, which is awesome. Um, and they have these necklaces, um, so hopefully I'm going to put something in here. 
uh, which has that's on, which has the next one. But you can see they have like one that says like feminist on it, one that says um, like riot with the little um, woman symbol. Um, they have one that says queer. Um, they have um, and then they have other ones as well. They have a really cool um, space uh, space necklace, uh, which is like the solar system, um, which is now on my Christmas list uh, because I ha don't I didn't have a really have a Christmas list. Um, uh Okay, I'm gonna fucking miss. Uh oh the battery's dying, oh and it's six minutes. Uh okay. Um yeah, uh that's a couple of ideas for Christmas I guess. That's oh, and pajamas. Because everyone it's Christmas and everyone needs everyone needs pajamas. Always buy people pajamas. Just just do. And make people things. Um don't just buy things. Uh if you want, don't just uh, you know, make make uh a cake to someone. Oh, I'm so sorry. Look, it was either no video or this rambling, sprawling, eight minute long or however long it's going to end up being mess. Um, quick add-on to the to the one, the not remotely one take video. Um, we have like over 70 subscribers, uh, which I'm not sure how that happened. Uh, some of you are from America and, and shiny new places. Uh, like that. Um, so hello, hello, uh, 70 subscribers. Um, cause we're, yeah, we're talking about Christmas. So I, uh, yeah, if you would like to get the Pesky Dames a Christmas present, Shane and Slug, Shane and Slug, Shane and Slug, it would be awesome if we could get to 100 subscribers by, um, by New Year, which, which doesn't seem un that unplausible. Unplausible? Is unplausible a word? No, unplausible is not a word. Stop rambling, Becca. Um, anyway, yeah, 100 subscribers by the new year. Yay, that would be amazing. And if you do, I will do a, uh, record a video of me doing a happy dance. Um, to celebrate. So there you go, that's an incentive. Um, yeah, thanks. Uh, click here to subscribe and tell your friends. And do guest videos and respond to videos and comment and like and other stuff. Uh, okay, I'll go now. Bye, 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 bye. Oh! Um, uh, and another, uh, Merry Christmas!